Hey everybody, I'm Philip, and in this video I'm going to watch the Little Mermaid live action fantasy movie trailer. I am not a Disney fan, but Disney has kind of crapped the bed recently on live action adaptations of their movies, in my opinion. That notwithstanding, let's get into the Little Mermaid official trailer. I'm not sure what to expect here, but uh, we'll see what's going on. Once, long ago, in the deep blue below. Don't <laughs> be silly, Grandmother. Everybody knows there's no such thing as mermaids. You wouldn't say that if you were in that one. You met a mermaid? This just came in. I wanted to take priority. And we followed stories like this before. Wood witches, woken mummies. <laughs> no, not like this. Hundreds of people have testified. Welcome to Mississippi. Hello. I really hope she's not the only African-American character in this movie because, um, and we'll just say that's very Disney. There's a powerful magic in you, a spirit of the ocean. Let me introduce you to your dreams. The Little Mermaid of the Mississippi. She was so beautiful, and I know she was real. I'm skeptical. Okay, this feels like one of those uh, family values Christian movies. They're all the same. They're copycat. They're cookie cutter. They're white people doing rich white people things or well-off white people things. This has the same vibe. I'm not saying it is. I'm trying not to read too much into this, but... I don't, I don't, I don't understand this. Okay, we'll just keep going. Let's keep going. You shouldn't be here. Mermaids. Not. He's cute. Exist. Of course he is. Look. Isn't it? Oh, wouldn't it be cool if she turned into a werewolf? The Little Mermaid Werewolf. Oh, I just made it better. Beautiful. I'm sorry, I have to go. Elizabeth. How can this be? It's okay. He knows I'm here. He's summoning me. We have to save her. She's changing. Ooh. Her soul is mine. Your soul is mine. So we've ripped off Mortal Kombat. We've ripped off Splash, which I haven't seen it. Awesome movie from the 80s with Daryl Hannah and Tom Hanks. How, how is this about the Little Mermaid? <laughs> I was expecting to see some like awesome live action Ursula played by like James Corden or something. I am not inspired. I believe. Mississippi's always been magic. I want a blue one. Okay, she. Hey, a werewolf! Ah, oh, it's on the wrong person though. It needs to be her. She needs to be the little mer little mermaid werewolf. Elizabeth, please. Oh, Miss Shirley McLean, what are you doing? Gina Gershon, what are you doing? So, some immediate questions I have. Shirley McLean and Gina Gershon, why are you in this? Two. What does this have to do with the Little Mermaid? Like you go from, you go from Ursula, who's awesome, to like cliche 
top hat and cane guy. He could have, he looked like he came from like a production of something wicked this way comes. And then number three, you pretty much don't need to see the movie now. They gave away the entire plot of the movie in the trailer. I understand now why TJ asked me to watch this one as well. I, I don't need to see it. They, uh, I've, I've seen movie trailers give away too much. That's why I usually don't watch them, but I don't think I've ever seen a movie trailer go this far and just here is the beginning. Here's how we find her. Here's how the evil guy comes. Here's what the evil guy does. Here's how we fight him. I don't know about this, y'all. I'm not sure what else to say. That just looked like Hallmark Channel cookie cutter rendition of the tired same love stories they tell over and over and over. I don't know. That looked just way too Hallmark for me. There's nothing Disney about this in the credits or anything here so um thankfully it's not a disney movie if this was disney oh my lord i would be raking this across the coals this is someone just using the title of the little mermaid to tell a very loosely based story and i use based very very loosely like they did so yeah we're gonna stop this one now because my brain hurts from this i don't understand this hallmark uh, Hallmark Channel nonsense. If you're into that sort of thing, cool. If you like cookie cutter movies that are exactly the same, cool. If you like fake, forced, contrived, see-through, transparent, like just completely saccharine happiness, happiness, then this is for you, I guess. Um, I can't imagine anyone that's a fan of The Little Mermaid or a fan of Disney or a fan of good movies, or a fan of Shirley MacLaine, or a fan of Gina Gershon, liking this. This is weird. I don't know why this is being made. It says 2018. I don't... Did it come out? I don't know. I don't follow this kind of thing. So, written and directed by Blake Harris. I will keep that name in mind of when I go to watch movies that don't have this person's name in them. So, that was going to wrap this one up. I just don't... My brain hurts. And my brain is just like, what did we just watch? That was way too much for me. That was way too much. Uh, just yeah, ugh, that was gross. I don't even like Disney. I'm offended for Disney fans. So yeah, we're going to wrap this one up. Uh, as always, I don't have a fancy outro. So I will just say thank you for watching. And I will see you in the next video, which hopefully won't be a cheap knockoff Hallmark BS Disney wannabe thing. Until then, goodbye.